This is a powder horn. It's around 1849 with a sterling silver top and cap. It's a, a very unique thing. Not many of them you'll find. It, it is very old. has writing on it. And that is sterling silver right there. Okay, we have two Nazi helmets here from World War II. These helmets prove Nazis weren't superhuman because if I put, try to put this on, you can see it doesn't even fit. Must have been for a little Nazi. But you know, any kind of Nazi is a Nazi. And it has some writing in there, F.W. Mueller, Berlin. And uh, it says, uh, Kompenfate or something like that. And it's definitely Nazi. You can see the little Nazi emblem, emblem right there. I believe this was Air Force. Luftwaffe. Here's another one. Same kind of flags, everything, but no emblem on this one. These are make offers. I have a lot of antiques here that I've collected in hauling jobs that I have for sale. It's make offers here. And you make the offer at 215-651-8329. This is a German Nazi flag. Around 1938-1939, Gauche, 80 by 135 centimeters. And it's actually from the Sudetenland. Okay. This is the official inaugural program from John F. Kennedy, January 20th, 1961. And as you can see, this is copy number 342 of a limited edition. And uh, this is the inauguration committee of John Kennedy and Lyndon Johnson. And uh, it's got all kinds of stuff in here from like Mr. Foley, the chairman. Of course, it's got the program and all the little good goodies that would go along with the program. Make offer 215 651 8329. We have a World War II Nazi Arbeitsbuch. This is, this is to let somebody work in Germany which uh, I don't think you need to really have a book for. They just they just usually shipped you there and made you work for free. But uh, it's got all those stampings in it. Okay. Okay, okay this is a, a Confederate flag, not very old, probably about 1975, 1985, and something like that. Yeah. Okay, this, this is an American helmet, I believe, from World War II. U.S. Army issue. Original condition, never restored. Okay. Postcards. This is the package type of postcards that are the elongated... Oh, no, these are just individuals. Where the Poconos, please. Endless Caverns, Virginia. Detroit, Michigan. Skyline Drive of Virginia. And Winchester... Okay, cool. This is the Leary's Ready Reckoner. It's a form book and wages calculator published in Philadelphia Leary & Company. Um, this is, was used to determine hourly wages based at 56 cents or 56 and a half cents, uh, 88 cents. All the pages are intact. The numbers are all legible. The pages are in good shape. And the binding looks like pre-World War II information, the Navy as a school. Everything is intact, showing Navy courses and training. We're here at Highland Hill Farm on Route 313 in Fountainville, PA. This is one of many of our fields that we have filled with Norway spruces. We have thousands of trees, plants, and shrubs. And this, this farm is located on Route 313 in Bucks County. We deliver and plant our Norway spruces and white pine trees and other trees up and down the East Coast. And we are able to deliver and plant to you from North Carolina to Boston and as far west we go as Pittsburgh. We're, we're a family run business, we have quite a few locations and we also have hunting opportunities for the people that like to hunt, fish, camp, look for arrowheads, hunt for fossils or meteorites. So give us a call at 215-651-8329 for your tree and shrub needs.